sick of the death. Cat says six. Wait. Yep. No, not you again. Sure. Oh man, the dude stay there. No, you get that, boy. Man. Oh, hey, let me stop that with that. Oh, goodness. No, not ya. Yeah, get over here. Come to me. Wait, wait. Gotta be some way of asking this asses. Send that. Somehow, some way. Wait. Oh no, 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 no. Oh. Wait, that's these things, eh? Give me these here. All right, now. Wait. Let's talk to this dog Dalmatian. Tegley sent me. You know, the famous painter. How about a discount? Famous painter? Edgar? <laughs> yeah, right. You don't give discounts or you don't think he's famous? Look, I'm sorry, but eating lunch every day in the art teacher's room does not make you a famous painter. Anyway, you only did that to hide out from the school wrestling team. Hey. There's no shame in hiding from wrestlers. They're trouble. Especially the wild animal type. Oh, what do you mean wild animals? Like dogs, eh? Oh, you got a problem with me now? No. I just meant wrestlers can be tough. I didn't mean you. Oh, you don't think I'm tough now? Why? Because I'm a Dalmatian? Hey, we can't all be St. Bernards and Bulldogs, you know. Has Edgar always had a problem with wrestlers? No way. In fact, he used to be the captain of his high school wrestling team. He took them all the way to the state semifinals one year, and then he... he choked. Cost the team the entire match. Why did he choke? Did they get him in one of those pile driver things? No. Edgar's girlfriend, Lana Panzoni, dumped him after the first period for Dean LeGrant, the head of her cheerleading squad. Techley was worthless after that. The other team just tossed him around the rest of the day like a half sack of pork rinds. Oh, man. His squad hated him after that. The whole school did. How sad. Especially since it all happened to him again with Dingo and Lampita. Oh, right. Yeah, they exist. Not made up at all, those two. Sheesh. Hey, I got some original Picassos over here if you're interested, by the way. See ya. 
Yes, run! Run from the horror! Oh, my foot. Oh, boy. How much should you... Okay, what I, I was I... going for here was a creeping vine. The kind that grows up walls. But it just ended up looking like a truck driver's hairy back. But without the charisma. Whoa! I forgot how crummy this one was. This stuff reeks. Ooh! Black Velvet hasn't been abused like this since the last time Mom got drunk in her prom dress. This painting reminds me of my grandpa's last year alive. Just one terrible stroke on top of another. I deserve to get my nose rubbed in this one. Whoa! Well, maybe you can write it off on your taxes as a loss. A catastrophic loss, even. See... How is this? Oh! Somebody light a match! This one really stinks! Ugh! This looks like electric clown barf in space! You see what I'm talking about? Woof! That's all I gotta say about that. I deserve to get my nose rubbed in this one. Ew! This one is so bad, somebody should take a rolled up newspaper and smack it. Just awful. This one is so bad, somebody should take a rolled up newspaper and smack it. Black Velvet hasn't been abused like this since the last time Mom got drunk in her prom dress. Yeah, you always say that, man. Let me just try that. Oh, man. Yeah. Time to build up so we can push it that last paint can. Do that right now. What the crap? Whoa, what the? Where are you, man? Where are you? Sorry. Get rid of you. Wait, and this area is called... Huh. All right. Damnation Alley. All right now. Come to me. Uh huh. Let's go to the tower. I'm gonna stop it here. Yeah. Yeah, man. I bet. Oh man, these things. All right, I'm uh go on ahead and stop it here, and next time try I finish this up and then. Move, move on to whatever next. So yeah, peace, peace out. Yeah.